right time. And now I'm looking down at a beautiful spaceport. Uh, congratulations to everybody for uh, for creating such a beautiful, beautiful place. Congratulations to all our wonderful team at Virgin Galactic for 17 years of hard, hard work to get us this far. All right, so I'm still happy we could catch a little part of that. It seems like there's a little bit of a delay in the transmission there. It does have a long way to travel. Um, but you could tell by the smiles on their faces, they just had the ride of their lives. We are so excited for them to land and party the rest of the day with, like astronauts, in the typical Virgin fashion. So we are at 22,000 feet now and descending. And as I mentioned earlier, Unity is a glider at this point. Um, so the pilots right now are discussing their energy management plan. And pretty shortly here, they'll be meeting up with our Chase aircraft with Jamil and Patrick to get some really cool visuals of Spaceship Unity. Now, as the crew and spaceship make their way across the desert, they are gliding over one of the most remarkable landscapes in the United States and the largest desert in North America, the Chihuahuan Desert. The area around Spaceport includes more than 6,000 square miles of restricted airspace and high desert, which is one of the reasons it was built here. And of course, our future astronauts will be able to take in so much of that natural beauty and, you know, of course, we also have White Sands nearby. White Sands National Park is just to our east. It's visible right over the Black Range Mountains. White Sands, of course, has been the backdrop for so many films, commercials, and music videos, and it's known for having the largest gypsum dune field on the planet. Khalid's music. So also nearby is the Oregon Mountain Desert Peaks National Monument, and that's nearly half a million acres of protected land that our guest families will be able to experience. And even though temperatures can hit the triple digits in the summer here, we also have cool desert days. And fortunately, our pilots and crew can stay comfortable thanks to their spacesuits. They were designed with our technical spacewear partner, Under Armour, and they're absolutely beautiful, as you can see on the crew there. They're lightweight and made of flight grid knitted fabrics, um, which forms the spacesuit and also helps regulate their body temperature. So also to commemorate this flight from New Mexico, we reached out to the Zia Pueblo, who gave us permission to use their sun symbol on our spaceship. This symbol is also a part of the New Mexico state flag, and it's embedded with symbolic meaning. The number four is sacred to the Zia people, and the emblem represents the four directions, the four seasons, the four times of day, and the four phases of life. We are honored and proud to feature this perfectly balanced symbol on Spaceship Unity's tail cone, as we also celebrate our new home. Oh, you can see the chase in the background there outside of Richard's window. The pilots are coordinating with Chase now and discussing their energy management plan. They're at about 9,500 feet in altitude, and the runway out here at Spaceport America is around 4,600 feet in altitude. All right, we have three landing gear down and locked. Now the pilots are gonna be landing on runway three, four today. So that's coming from the south and towards the north for those of you on site watching. 
And for the non-pilots tuning in, those numbers represent the first two numbers of the magnetic heading of the runway. So for example, 34 is 340 degrees on your compass. We are just about 1,000 feet above the field now and on final. 500 feet above the runway, 300 feet. Over the threshold. Main gear, touchdown. And we're gonna hold it just like this for a minute before bringing the nose down. Can see they're already celebrating inside there. And the nose is coming down now. Nose gear touchdown. And braking. that incredible drone footage here as we come in. And there is full stop. All right. A perfect landing Virgin Galactic or mission specialist on board from our operational home base, Spaceport America. A beautiful day of flight. What a moment. Congratulations to everybody on board and, of course, our very own Spaceship Unity who returned to space today. And, of course, we also saw beautiful flying from our EVE crew, CJ and Kelly, and brilliant work by our chase pilots, Jamil and Patrick, all of whom are still in the air right now. Great job to you all.